What's up, you guys? This is Mary with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel side and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is an oracle card reading for Sinus Sagittarius. If this can resonate if you have side to any aspect to your chart. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Earth, No, Moon, Hammer, Jupiter, Charge. Stuff to the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free general take your reading for Sinus Sag. Um, I feel guided to do Sag first, and then I heard Sag, so that was my confirmation to do it. So I am doing Sag first for a round of Oracle card readings for the signs, so we are on Sag. Um, I hope everybody's doing well. If you think anyone else would like my channel or the videos, please feel, please feel free to share them very publicly on social media and word of mouth. I very much appreciate it. We have strength and healing. Number two or four could be very significant numbers in one's life. Number two or four could be a possible age of a child of yours or somebody you're connected to or any other significant number in one's life. Two or four. We have strength and healing. Spirit messages here on my side. I haven't received uh, received any channeling then yet, but if I do, I will let you know. Okay. Uh, don't forget the basics. As always, only take the messages that resonate leave the rest. Um, free general collective reading, okay? Do not force anything that doesn't fit. That is very, very, very important, okay? Nightingale and black egg. I apologize. Let me just check this real quick. And that's confirmation with my phone. A Sagittarius is about to get communication soon about a job opportunity. For one, you do not have a vehicle and you will have to walk, but it will be worth it. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So one of you guys is about to get communication about a job opportunity soon. Um sounds like it hasn't happened yet it's upcoming uh whoever this is for i'm presuming you don't have a vehicle um i heard you will have to walk but i heard it will be worth it um financial freedom so you plug it in how it resonates sag that's at least for one of you guys i feel like you be masculine or feminine um you don't have a vehicle if that resonates for you i'm feeling you don't because i heard you don't you don't have a vehicle but it sounds like whatever job opportunity this is it sounds like it's within reasonable walking distance um, if that resonates for you. Definitely within reasonable walking distance. Okay, confirmation. Definitely within reasonable walking distance. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Okay, so we have bat, they take care. Enemies are working against you. Bo, you are highly thought of. Through many series of chain of events, a Scorpio and a Pisces is about to get their vehicle repossessed. It's about to shock the hell out of you. And a Leo. Whoa. So um, you plug it in how it resonates. Through many series of chain events, a Scorpio, a Pisces, and a Leo is about to get their vehicle repossessed. I heard it's about to shock the hell out of you. Whoa. And an Aries. And an Aries. A Scorpio, a Pisces, a Leo, and an Aries are about to get their vehicles repossessed. I heard it's about to shock the hell out of you. Um... So, whoever these people are, it's not you, Sag. It's, I think you're about to see this manifest in 3D if this resonates for you. Um, it's a Scorpio, a Pisces, um, a Leo, or Aries. They could have Scorpio, Pisces, Leo, or Aries, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, Moon, 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 Charts. If they're getting their vehicles repossessed, that means they are behind on payment or payments. Um, my vehicle's paid off, so I don't know how the repossession process works, but... Somebody out there, I think, is behind on one payment or two or two plus payments. It could be a masculine or feminine, Scorpio, Pisces, Leo, or Aries. They could have Scorpio, Pisces, Leo, or Aries in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, Moon, 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 Jupiter, Charts. And a Virgo. And a Virgo. What is up with all these people about to get their vehicles repossessed? Scorpio, Pisces, Leo, Aries, Virgo. It could be masculine or feminine, Scorpio, Pisces, Leo, Aries, or Virgo. Vehicle repossession, you're about to see this, is what I'm feeling, um, Sagittarius. Um, if this resonates for you, holy crap. 
and a Gemini. And a Gemini. Scorpio, Pisces, Leo, Aries, uh, Virgo, uh, Gemini. Masculine or feminine? I think you're about to see this. Holy crap. And one of you guys is about to get a job offer. It's within walking distance. You don't have a vehicle. Vehicles are very significant in here. Um, how would that resonate? A Sagittarius is very high in the spiritual realm. Very high. High vibrational Sagittarius feminine. Very high in the spiritual realm. She's about to do return to cinder spells. And keep her energy blocked from negative energies. And it's about to benefit her in a huge way. Okay, so you plug it in. How it resonates. That's beautiful. So you're a Sag Femme. High vibrational Sag Femme. You treat people honestly, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrity, and values. Heard you're about to keep your energy blocked from negative energies. So I think you've already identified the negative energies. Or you're about to. And I heard you're about to uh, block your energy from the negative energies. Or you already have how that resonates. But um, but how that resonates, um, I heard it's going to benefit you in a huge way. So I feel you're about to block your energy is what I'm feeling. You know, I think that's blocking communication from like text or verbal or, um, or um, being around them in the 3D or whatever that is for you, Sag. You're a high vibrational Sag femme. You could have Sag in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, more feminine energy for your charts. Um, but I think they're black eggs in your life um, is what I think. I think they're black eggs in your life and you know they're working against you. And I heard you're very high in the spiritual realm and you're very high vibrational. So you're very highly thought of in the spiritual realm. And, uh, and you think highly of yourself as far as self-care. So that's why you're about to block these people out of your life if you already haven't. It's going to give you healing and give you strength to move forward is exactly what I feel. But you plug it in, how it resonates, um, Sag. That's really beautiful. That resonates for you. Nightingale. A Sagittarius has been under heavy spiritual attack. Return to Cinder Baby. It's about to benefit in such a huge way. High vibrational. High vibrational uh, Sagittarius has been under heavy spiritual attack. So people have been throwing blows in the spiritual realm at you, if that resonates for you. Um, and I heard you're about to return to cinder back. So you're about to do return to cinder, life side return to cinder um, spells. And um, I think you're about to speak it out in the universe. Um, manifest it out in the, three, in the 3D in the universe and return to cinder. Of course, only you know what you're going to do, but... That's exactly what I think you're going to do. And um, I heard it's going to benefit you in a huge way. So return. And there's nothing wrong with return to sender spells. You can't help the people throw negative energy blows at you in the spiritual realm. But you can protect yourself. And whoever you are, you're about to protect yourself. You're about to speak it out with your nightingale beak here. That's what I'm feeling. For some, it could be an air sign that's throwing blows at you, possibly. Because we have air sign energy in here. Or anybody else that has, um, or any, any other sign. But... We have air sign energy in here. Maybe it's a Gemini Libra Aquarius. Maybe it could be somebody else. But however that resonates, Sag, you're about to speak it out. Throw those blows back in the spiritual realm. I heard it's going to benefit you in a huge way. Return to center spells. Evil eye protection. You're highly thought of the spiritual realm. And you think highly of yourself. And you should. And it's going to promote healing. And you're going to have strength to do it. Black egg. A married Sagittarius feminine realizes her husband is a serious, is seriously into dark arts in the past and now. About to cut him loose. Holy crap. Okay, so if this resonates for you, you're a Sag femme and you're married. 
you're married, you were legally married. And I heard um, basically you realize your current husband, whoever your current husband is, or however that resonates, for some it could be an air sign husband, for some it could be any other sign of husband. I only say that because we have air sign energy in here, but it can be any sign. Um, I heard they, uh, they've done dark arts in the past and they're in the dark arts now. You're about to cut them loose, i.e. divorce. So you're about to go for a divorce court. Now, you know, there's contested divorces and non-contested divorces. It really all depends on your uh, properties and assets and what have you, what have you. So only you know if your uh, husband will agree to a contested or non-contested. Only you know that, not anybody else, okay? But you're identifying him as a black egg. You are currently legally married to him. This is your husband in this aspect. Does this resonate for you? Fire sign energy and air sign energy, husbands. Fire sign energy and air sign energy husband. So Aries Leo Sagittarius and um, uh, Gemini Libra Aquarius husbands. So you only you know what sign your husband is, not anybody else, ma'am. Uh, you're currently legally still, still married to them. Aries Leo Sag or Gemini Libra Aquarius. They can have Aries Leo Sag or Gemini, Gemini Libra Aquarius and their sun, moon, rising, Venus, wolf, moon, moon, Hamid, Jupiter charts. If that resonates for you. Bad, take care. Enemies are working against you. An adoption is about to fall through, and a custody change is about to become very significant. An adoption is about to fall through, and a custody change is about to become very significant. So, um, some kind of adoption is about to fall through. That could be you trying a, to adopt person, people, place, or person or people, um, kid or kids, or somebody else trying to adopt kid or kids. Some kind of adoption is about to fall through, if that resonates for you, Saj. And, um, 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 uh, there's about to be a significant custody change. So that could be you that had um, custody change regarding you and child or children or somebody you're connected to. But enemies are working against you. Take care. Um, I think you're involved in this um, custody change or this ado adoption process that is about to fall through in some shape, form, or fashion, or you know somebody that is. How that resonates? Let's see if we hear anything else. Also, I think this is the spiritual attack energy as well. I just want to say that in the spiritual realm. All right, I didn't hear anything else, but I do feel spiritual attack energy heavy there, especially with the black egg energy. You're highly thought of. A Sagittarius is about to file an official report, abuse of power on a position of high authority. It's about to benefit you in a huge way. You are lower, you are lower economic status and they are very high economic status. And they have looked down upon you. You are about to transmute the energy. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So if this resonates for you, your lower economic status and whoever you're about to file this official report on, I heard they're very high economic status. Um, so they make a lot of money and you don't make a lot of money, basically, if that resonates for you. Um, but you're about, I heard you're about to file this official report on them for abuse of power. So they have abuse, abuse of power. They have abuse their power in some shape or fashion. Now, whoever this person is and how do they resonate, I feel for some, it could be your manager, boss, supervisor, or CEO, or it could be somebody um, else that has abused their power on you. It could be um, state officials, government officials, anybody that has abused their power. You are about to make the official report on them, Sagittarius. I heard it's about to benefit you greatly. I think you're about to get recognition, public recognition for this, um, because you're identifying the abuse of power people. Um, whoever these person or people are, okay? Kudos to you. Healing.
a spa day. And child grooming identified. A spa day and child grooming identified. So, um, what do you guys has already taken? I feel you could have already taken a spa day or you're about to take a spa day. Or you know somebody that likes to go for spa days. Or you work, you know somebody that works at a spa for spa days. I mean, I don't know. You plug in how it resonates. And um, someone... Uh, uh, child grooming identified. So that could be you identifying child grooming. Somebody to child groom somebody or uh, somebody else has ch identified child grooming. Somehow child grooming has been identified, whether you have identified it or somebody else has. You plug it in, how it resonates. Strength. A very light side, Sag Femme, that has been bullied targeted and harassed is about to get a lot of strength from a from a reader it's about to benefit her in huge ways she's about to make huge positive changes to her life well that's beautiful sag you are a sag femme you're high vibrational you treat people honestly trust respect morals ethics integrities and values heard you're about to get a lot of strength from a particular reader now i hope it's me but it could be any reader um, i feel you're going to watch my reading so hopefully it's for me but it really can be any reader because there's a ton, ton of us out here. So it could be me and other people or another person or people or me or what have you, what have you. But how oh, there is an H, you're about to gain a lot of strength from another reader and um, from a reader. So whoever that is or readers, maybe for some. Heard reader, but you plug it in how it resonates. Um, and I heard it's about to benefit you in a huge way. So I don't feel this is energy sucking here. I feel this is just positive, copacetic advice or information or motivation is what i feel you plug it in how it resonates if that resonates for you um sagittarius okay A very dark side Libra feminine, older Libra feminine is about to be exposed for dark arts, heavy police involvement, heavy. It's about to shock the hell out of you. They have a lot of evidence, a lot of evidence. They're about to move in. Spells, selling of spell book, text messages and group chats. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates, Sag. So it's an older Libra feminine. They could have Libra in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, and Midham, Jupiter your charts. She's very, um, she's very dark arts. So she's a true witch. She's a, I mean, she's not no fun kitchen witch, God witch shit. She's true, like, sacrificial energy. Like, I'm feeling sacrificial energy of, like, animals or people or, um, or using the, like, the legal, um, uh, black market organ. Uh, transplant and donor shit um, behind the scenes um, using the blood off that shit for sacrifices um, she's very I mean she truly is dark art shit I mean she goes does most shit um, so much so that I heard the police already had the police about to move in on her or they already have a ton of um, evidence somebody has either one person or several people have already um uh, Send in evidence to the police, so a police precinct or precincts regarding her. Um, I heard spell book and spells and group chats and texts and um, all kinds of shit. So I wonder if she was selling the spell book um, or spells to people or sending the spell book or spells to people to um, for some kind of negative. Let me see if I hear anything else. My God, I think you're about to have a lot of strength to learn about this. I heard it's about to shock the hell out of you. Please, are about to move in on her. Heading a coven. And has been for years. For one, you're about to help with this information. 
petting a coven and has been for years. For one, you're about to move in. Uh, you're about to help with this information. So, um, she's been heading a coven and she has been for years. Um, if that resonates for you, Saj. Whoever this dark arts witch, like true witch is. Like, she is a dark arts spiritualist. Like, a true witch. Like, like she don't just wear the pointy hat at Halloween. Like, she really is. Through her actions. Um, She's been trying to take out a feminine energy, light side feminine energy for years. But it's about to seriously backfire on her. She's been trying to take out a light side feminine energy for years. It's about to backfire on her. For one, it is her sister. For one, it is another reader. For one, it is her sister. And for one, it's another reader. So there's two dark side Libra Fems in here. For one, it's her sister. And for one, it is her... Um, um, an, another person, a, a light side reader, light side spiritualist like me. Um, the, the other, the light side reader could do online public platform or be a home reader. I'm not sure, but she's, um, whoever these dark side 40 and above Libra Femmes are, the, uh, they're using their, they're ahead of a coven. So they're using their coven or has used their coven. I heard for years to try to take out either their sister or light side sister, I'm presuming, or light side reader for some of these libra fans it could be both i mean they're that dark i mean killing is their game death is their game are they been trying to take them out so like kill them with dark arts is what i'm feeling or some other kind of way um but the police are about to move in i think they have um evidence on some kind of um um intent to kill or premeditated uh, murder or murders or premeditated assault or assaults or some kind of premeditated um, criminal activities, whatever that might be. Um, yikes, this is terrible. Um, whoever this is, I think you know this older Libra feminine or you're connected to her in some shape, form or fashion. She's either trying to take out her sister and for some, you could be the sister, possibly. For some, it's another light side reader. Um, you could be the light side reader or somebody else. I mean, this is, I heard you're about to be shocked. She's about, to, I mean, and for one, you're going to send the evidence to the police about this person. Um, this is premeditated plans to keep, literally, in this aspect, kill these people. So, um, and somehow spell books and spells are significant in here. Um, I think the one about to uh, send this information to the police, if this resonates for you, I think you're about to have strength and healing. I mean, I'm sorry, you think you're about to have strength. Um, you could have Leo on your chart, possibly, if you do. This is Leo energy or not. But however that resonates, you're about to have a lot of strength to um, um, send this evidence to the police, basically, if this resonates for you. Um, whoever you are and it's going to promote healing i think um kudos to you god this is this is some sick twisted shit um her she's ahead of a coven so hopefully if you're the one about to send the evidence to the police hopefully you have evidence that she is ahead of a coven to pro substantiate your claim that she really is the head of this coven so they can connect her the police can connect her appropriately for one you are the police for one, you are the police. For one, you are the police. Wow. Whoo wee! You plug it in. How it resonates, you guys? Y'all get so spicy in here. There is about to be a huge COVID sting soon. Huge. There's about to be a huge COVID sting. Uh, huge. A huge COVID sting. So, a COVID. Man, it's good to see that society's supporting. Um, it's more it's more supporting of um, wanting to lock up the dark arts people. Because. Yeah, you know, people can go around and laugh and say, oh, yeah, they said they're using magic. Hee-haw, hee-haw, hee-haw. But that, that shit really does exist. It really does exist, and it really does harm people. And it makes people's physical, it could, it can make people's physical health decline, their mental health decline, their lives decline, 
I mean, it really is a real thing. Um, whether people want to believe it is or not. I mean, I've never done dark arts, nor do I ever want to, nor will I ever. But my point is, it's dangerous. It's dangerous. And people really do use people as sacrifices, and they use animals as sacrifices. And um, it's dangerous. So it's good to see that some police precinct out there is about to take this seriously, is what I'm trying to say. Kudos if you, I heard one, you are the police. So kudos if you are the police about to assist in this. Or is about to assist in this. Um, I think you're highly thought of. I think highly of you. I'm just saying. I, I think highly of you. If you were in the police precinct about to help with this. Or is helping with this. Or is about to take this seriously. Because so many people out there don't take these kind of things seriously. And I'm just being serious about that. Okay. And obviously I think the black egg here is the COVID energy as well. Um, the busting up of this COVID. Um, and take care. Be careful when you do this. Um, if this resonates for you or if you're in the police force about to help with this, um, my, my hat's off to whoever is in the police force that is uh, uh, hopefully going to take this seriously or already has taken this seriously or is about to take this seriously or is about to assist in this. Um, black egg. That's the COVID energy. I feel in that aspect. Um, that's that's wonderful. Because we need more people in the world that thinks more out of the box and more open-minded to what people really do do in the damn world. And that's the truth. So, all right, we're done. Let me see if I hear anything else. Miranda, Lacey, Jennifer, D. Miranda, Lacey, Jennifer, and D. And J. Miranda, Lacey, Jennifer, D, and J is what I heard. Miranda, Lacey, Jennifer, and then the initial D and the initial J. Um, and the initial C. And the initial C. Miranda, Lacey, Jennifer. So Miranda, Lacey, or Jennifer. It could be your name or somebody you're connected to's name. Or any other significant number. Uh, I'm sorry, not number. It's any other significant name in one's life. Miranda, Lacey, or Jennifer. And then uh, J, D, and C initials. So J, D, or C could be initial of you or somebody you're connected to, first, middle, or last initial, or a nickname initial of you or somebody you're connected to, or any other significant initial, J, D, or C. All right. I love you guys. I really hope this helped. If you think anyone else will like my channel, please feel free to share it very publicly on social media word of mouth. I love you guys so much, and namaste.